Esme? Esme, come on! Okay, so it's very, very early. It's not even six o'clock yet. Um, I'm here with Dreamer, who we're going to be taking to the beach. And at the moment, Kate is just loading Nero. Yes! Are you excited for the beach ride? Oh! <laughs> You're so pretty. I love your little freckles. I really hope Joey goes freckly and flea bitten like this, because it's just so pretty. Hello everybody, this is me and today's video is going to be a day in the life of Blob the Cob, aka Kate Lewis. So we've got Kate here, Hello. <laughs> who is currently um, getting um, Dreamer and also Nero ready in the van because we're now going off to the beach. It's not even six o'clock in the morning yet, so it's very early. Um, so yeah, let's go for a ride. I was just wondering if you could bring it for me. In the in the tack room, my, my riding hat, my normal one, the cask one. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Bye. Is that the beach, buddy? When Nero begins to kick up, he's like, Where are you taking your way out, mate? Your steer? <laughs> so, um, we can't quite go down to the beach just yet because, um, Kate might have forgotten not only her hat but also her boots. But, um, <laughs> luckily, you were saying that your show boots were yeah. still got away in with the, the van. <laughs> um, my dad is kindly bringing my hat down this morning, is although I don't think he's going to be very happy with me. Oh. Um, so yeah, he's going to be a bit grouchy because it's about 6am now, yep. so he Very wasn't early. expecting to have to get up this morning, so uh, <laughs> he's not going to be too thrilled, but never mind. <laughs> it's all good. It's worth it. It's fine.
Oh my goodness, guys, that was so much fun. Nero and Dreamer were so good. We had some lovely blasts and gallops across the beach. So yeah, it was a lot of fun. We've just um, loosened their girths off and getting them ready to take them home. <laughs> Driving with Kate. <laughs> Driving with Kate. Because one people, I'm used to be shopping with the size of I have something slightly better. I'll use the actual bike. Hey, Suki. Hello. Hey, Paris. No, Dreamer. Come on. Here we go. Well done. Thank you for the ride. Joey's girlfriend. Hey, Paris. You're so pretty. Okay, so Puff and Check are the yep. two sales of Ruse. Cool. They have been out since five o'clock this morning before yes. we went to the beach. Very early. So it's time for them to come in so the others can go out. Yep. Obviously, they don't go out at the same time because they're new horses that have come on the yard, so yeah. we have to keep them separate. So they're almost quarantined in a way. He's so cute. <laughs> <laughs> so sweet. Go. Good boy. You can leave the gate open oh, if you okay. want because we're bringing the others down in a few minutes. So then when yes. we get over there, I'll stop off and get Puff. For some reason, I feel like I always get given the greys. Like wherever I go, whatever I'm doing, always with the grey. <laughs> we're a dreamer this morning who's a grey. And now with him. <laughs> There we go, so I'll let you lead away with him. Cool. And then I'll follow behind with Puff. Good boy. Come in. <laughs> he knows where he's going. <laughs> he knows the route. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Puff is still getting settled in, so I like to lead with Check first so that Puff can sort of follow and yeah. get his bearings because he hasn't been here that long. Yeah, so Check is going into the shaving stable cool. and then I'll put Puff in the one with the straw. Nice. Oh, it looks like we've just got them in in time yeah, as well. It's like raining. <laughs> just starting to chuck it down. Good boy. Come on then. Wait a sec. Let me do your door. There we go. Cool. So we have the two broodmares yep. and we have Carly. Oh. Um, we'll take the broodmares down first, yep. so I'm just going to chuck Carly a bit of red grass. Okay. Because uh, obviously with the other horses leaving, I yeah. don't want her to get upset. And oh, there's so no cute. better way to stop her getting upset than with food. Yes. <laughs> Hello. Oh, you're so pretty. Yeah. Is it ready grass time? Oh, so we get a nice handful of this. Oh. <laughs> and you should really like this, shouldn't you? There you go. So that's her sorted. And then I'm going to grab Evie's fly rug because yep. Evie is so sensitive with the flies <laughs> at this time of year. She's one of those horses, the flies target her every single yeah. year. Um, and obviously, with her being in foal now, yep. we can't use like products to get yeah. flies away from them because in the early stages, don't chew the microphone. <laughs> in the early stages of her pregnancy and things, things like that can put the foal at risk. Yeah. Um, so we have to be very careful oh, with that. It's very so exciting though. It's so exciting. <laughs> we honestly, we can't wait. I, I mean, we weren't expecting her to take first time either. Aww. So uh, yeah, we're very happy because she's, uh, she's 13 now as Evie. So oh, wow. she's uh, an older first mum, but Aww. I'm sure she's going to be a really good mum. Yeah. Okay, sorted. Who would you like to take? I don't mind. I think Madge is Madge. summoning you. Yes. <laughs> Just take me. I love both these mares. They're both so sweet yeah. and uh, just easy, uh, which is nice to have as brood mares because uh, Harriet definitely isn't easy. Yep. <laughs> so um, a hormonal Harriet is uh, even worse than usual. Oh. <laughs> but these two, I think, are going to be a walk in the park, yeah. hopefully. Aren't you, Missy? Okay, let's go. Oh. <laughs> So we're taking these two down to the bottom field. Um, so they have like a slightly bigger field. Yeah. And they're actually next to where Harriet and the foal are going to be going when they oh. come home. So I'm sure they'll find that very exciting. <laughs> 
it's kind of just overgrown, overtaken us this year. Oh. Do you want that? This is going oh, okay. to be Bye. Oh. Are you two running away or are you going to be... Oh, I think Evie just knows I've got treats. Yeah. <laughs> so go with Nan, you're not having anything. Oh, little snorts. Okay, so I'm going to go get Carly now. Oh. Um, and I thought while I'm putting her out, mm -hmm. um, you can bring Dotty. So um, <laughs> Dotty, as you saw yesterday, yes. she is the little Shetland, She's the so new cute. one. She's adorable. <laughs> um, I'm taking Carly down to the bottom field yeah. and then she's going in that big middle field, which she will cool. love. Yeah. Um, so if you sort of wait, you can bring her out and then just wait until I've taken Carly down. Yeah. And once I've got her in, you can release her. Cool. Cool. So I will see you in a minute. See ya. <laughs> okay, let's go and get Dotty. So here she is. As you can see, she's a little bit smaller, um, especially compared to Dreamer here. Dreamer's stable doors all the way up here. And then hers is down here, which is so cute. So I'm just going to go in and grab her head collar. Oh, I think she's excited. <laughs> oh, as you can see, um, you can see Carly, can't you? Yes. I'm going to walk. Okay, let's let you out into the field then. Oh, buckles stuck. There we go. Off you go. <laughs> oh, look at her go. So is this Paris? This is Paris. Yeah, Joey's, Joey's girlfriend. girlfriend. Yeah. So we got them at kind of similar times and um, they're yeah, both, they both look quite similar. So we're like, oh my gosh. <laughs> Doppelgangers, aren't you? Yeah. <laughs> You're so cute. So she's going out in the field today. Unfortunately, Aww. last week Paris had a slip in the field oh, no. and she has done something to her back. So we're going to leave her in the rug she's in today because yeah. I like to keep with a back injury, keep her nice and warm. Yeah. Um, so no. she won't be roasting, but just keep that back nice oh, and warm. These baby so horses like Joey, oh my goodness. When oh. he goes out with Mickey and Casper and they just run around, around and, like, some and of the around. moves he busts, I'm like, no, please don't hurt please yourself. Don't. Calm down. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's just one of those things, I yeah. guess. And uh, hopefully you'll be all good, won't you? Yeah. Time to go out <laughs> in the field then. Ziggy thinks he's being left out. We'll come oh, back and no. get you, Ziggy, I promise. <laughs> yeah, you went in Paris. There we go. Come on, Dreamer. Here is your treat. Good girl. You're so sweet, aren't you? Yeah, your spotty nose. Oh. <laughs> they're like the perfect size to give them a cuddle. They are, they're proper cuddle size. Yeah. You can like crouch at the side and they're like, they're, they are proper cuddly. So here we have Tilly. And um, today I'm going to be riding her. It's very exciting. I think we're going to be doing some flat work today. Um, so she had a bath this morning. So she's now looking all nice and clean. Um, so now it's time to get her tacked up and ready to ride. Okay, so um, Tilly is only five and she's recently just come back into work. So at the moment, Kate's giving her a little bit of a warm up to see what she's like. Um, and then I'm going to have a little ride on her. <laughs> Great. Oh, good girl. Why are you going with your Auntie Esme? She's yet. like, oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> You're kidding. <laughs> okay, that's all right. No. She feels so different to what I'm used to. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> She feels so nice once you get going. She's like, yeah, she just, she's lovely. I have nothing negative to say about Tilly. She's Aww. just a dream. Feel different? Yeah. <laughs> she's got such a sweetie little canter. She does. She flies, don't you Tilly? Now the odd bit of leg, a little bit of inside flexion and she's, she's down. But also she's for great. a five year old, she feels so balanced. Yeah. like. Especially she's just literally just come back into work. Like she's been in work about a week. Like Oh wow. So she's this is probably like her third schooling session 
since she's been back out of the field for like six oh, months. She's schooled so nicely. So she's, like, she's really nice. She's, she's the so easiest lovely. youngster I've ever had in my life. Oh wow. Like, the third time when we had her, she'd been sat on like once or twice, I think. Yeah. And by her like fourth ride, she was already just like this, like going yeah. around in an outline, able to like hold herself and carry herself over trotting poles. We were like, whoa. What? <laughs> Oh, she's so cool. She's so pretty, aren't you? Oh. Hey? Oh, yeah. I was in the right ballpark. You know when you throw it on yeah. and then it's just completely wrong? And yeah. you think, what on earth? You're so cute, aren't you, mister? Come on then, buddy. You're coming to ride? Are you going to have a go at doing some of your first jumps in, oh, like, six jumping. months? Hey? Don't know what to expect from him. It could be a complete disaster, but we will see. <laughs> so today we're gonna see what he's like, possibly yeah. have our first little pop on him Ooh. since in like six months. So we're just gonna get him groomed and get him ready and then, then we'll have a little go. Nice. And if he's a good boy, then you can have a go on him as well. Yay. <laughs> a good boy who's just had so long off that, yeah like, you know when you bring them back and you're yeah. like hmm i'm not sure today <laughs> cool there we go oh good good boy oh, nice little face. <laughs> he has such a nice little pop on him good boy good lad <laughs> Is that alright? Yeah, that's all good. Cool. Alright, Van Van, let's have another schnitzel. I'm always like this though, I'm so like babyish with them when they when they haven't jumped in ages. Yeah. Good oh, lad. He's so cool. <laughs> See, he's a good boy really. <laughs> that's fine. He just like he just takes some moving forward and he gets all oh. sassy about it. And I yeah. think he does that to try and put you off moving him yeah. forward. And then once you've got him there, you're good. Mm. Good boy, that. <laughs> He's off. <laughs> That's it, just go with him, lots of leg. Woo! Woo yeah! So Perfect. Lovely. Well done. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> that was so good. Good boy, Van Van. <laughs> yeah. Just trot the lucky. Nah. Nah. <laughs> nah. Just like Casper's like, I'm either lazy or I'm going. <laughs> yeah. Oh, the camera oh, is. Oh, scary camera. Oh, oh no. <laughs> So this is one of our rescued kittens. Um, me and my mum have taken to rescuing and rehoming some kittens this year. Um, so this one is part of a litter that came from a yard near here um, who had several feral cats who had just bred and bred and bred and this yard was just overrun with kittens and uh, they were desperate to sort of get rid of them and find them somewhere to go. So we stepped in and we have rehomed a lot of them but these are the ones that remain. Um, this is Flower. We are actually keeping this one because he's particularly adorable and we've fallen for this one so much. Oh, so <laughs> he's such a poser as well, aren't you? Uh, these ones are about eight weeks old now. Um, so uh, we actually hand reared these ones, we bottle fed them. Um, so they're very, very tame. But yeah, they're lovely. Esme has one too. Yeah. <laughs> so Esme. Meet Dingbat. Hello, Dingbat. <laughs> I think you recognised this when you yeah, first arrived. Yeah, when we first went to the bar and I was like, oh, is That's that the Dingbat? <laughs> so it's finally time, your time has come. Yep. You're going to learn how to drive Dingbat. Oh, exciting. Okay. 
Okay. My head again. So your clutch and your brake is your red handlebar there. Yep. Okay. Um, so and your accelerator is the lower handlebar on your left hand. Yes. Cool. Yep. Right hand even. Yep. <laughs> your left. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And that's pretty much. Then you've got your gear change down here. Cool. Yeah. So forward is like first. Yep. Yeah. And then you sort of wiggle it around, and somewhere in the middle you'll find reverse. But you shouldn't need to use it yep. unless you really mess up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so all you need to do to turn it on is that little key there. Yeah. Yep. So twist the key. And then hold the button down, and no, no, the other one, the black knob oh, on the front, oh, yeah. yeah, there. And then hold the accelerator at the same time. So key, button, and accelerator. Okay. And then Ding back complete. Ding back complete. <laughs> Woo! Well done, COVID five. <laughs> Everything we need in place. Ready, car, race. Right? Yes. <laughs> Riding for the yes. day. Now it's on to the real hard work. Okay. Unfortunately. Yep. Yep. <laughs> Every yard has to deal with the mucking out. Yeah. <laughs> so we have 14 stables in total to okay. look at. We yep. have already done a few today, luckily yes. for you. So we have 11 left. <laughs> okay. And I thought to make it more fun, we would have a race. Okay. And challenge is on. Yep. <laughs> and see how many we can get done between us in the amount of time okay. and see who does the most. Okay. So yeah, there's no set amount that we're doing. See who gets there quicker and who can do the and, most. Yeah. If you do more than me, then yeah. there will be a special prize. Oh, okay. And I am willing to donate to you a Blob the Cop t-shirt and a Magnum. Oh, yay. Oh, Not a classic, classic one. my favourite. You can have a white one. Okay, I'll have the white chocolate one. <laughs> Count yourself lucky I'm giving okay. you that. <laughs> Thank you. But you have, to, you have to beat me in the race okay. in order to win it. So are you up for the challenge? I'm up for the challenge. Okay. Let's go. Let's get started. guys I think I've actually finished so at Cake's Yard there's like three different kind of blocks there's the main one up at the top there's the middle one and there's the bottom one down here so I did I think I've actually done the whole of the middle block and the whole of the bottom block but I think they're both called the bottom block so sometimes she calls this one the bottom bottom block anyway the middle block has three stables so I did all of those first then I came down here and I thought you know what 
I'll do Dottie's stable first, because obviously she's a Shetland, she's very small, she has the smallest stable, so I thought, you know what, I'll be sneaky, do the small one first, and then I was like, because I preferred doing shavings rather than doing straw, so I went for the, um, I think this is Ziggy's stable that has shavings, so I was like, okay, I'll do him next, and then I was like, okay, I just need to do one more, and then I basically won, um, so I did that straw stable, and then... Kate's still not down here, so I've done her last stable. I don't know what she's doing, having a cup of tea break, a magnum break, I don't know, but let's go see what she's up to. Hiya. Oh. <laughs> Hi, how are you getting on? Yeah, um, good, I've ended up doing seven stables. Are you on your fourth at the moment, I believe? Um, yeah. So I think I might, I might have won that magnum classic you were talking about. I think I'm gonna have to give you the magnum classic, aren't I? Yep. <laughs> You can only have one the entire time you're here. Okay, okay. <laughs> That's the deal, okay? I will treasure it and savour it. Uh-huh. <laughs> okay, guys. Got that sweet, sweet victory, baby. Ta-da! <laughs> so, Esme, if you thought those kittens were cute, yeah. get a load of these guys. Oh my goodness, they're adorable! <laughs> they are! <laughs> the, if you thought the show jumpers were good as well, they're yep. all on a break at the moment, so we're going to bring out the real show jumpers yep. and uh, let you have a play with them. Cool, let's get them out! <laughs> Ta-da! Here they are! <laughs> Hello, Hello. 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 Oh my gosh guys, Diddy is so cute, he's so cool as well, like we were jumping some pretty wide oxes at times, like oh my goodness he's so like agile and nimble, so yeah I heard that you've also got a new Shetty Games um, video coming out soon which is yes. very well known for your YouTube channel. Yes I do, we've got <laughs> all eight Shetlands are competing and we are actually doing a mini major. That's so, so cool. So uh, we paired them off with the big horses. <laughs> 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 We've paired them off with the big ones yeah. and uh, they've each done a little course each and it's, it's a great video oh. so I, I can't wait to bring that out but yeah. <laughs> oh that's so exciting so what's the plan next? So we've seen the Shetlands, yeah. we're going to take them back over to their field now and then I think it's about time you had a go on Nero. <gasps> <laughs> oh Diddy! Oh, exciting! Yeah! <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 
So we are going to jump one of my sales liveries now, oh, or Puff. That's um, exciting. So here we're going to do some grid work with him today. Yeah. This is the second time I've ever jumped him. Um, so. He's very, he expressed himself a lot the yeah. first time. <laughs> so we're just going to see how he goes today. I'd like to put him through a grid, just kind of let him find his own, own way. And I think yeah. it's really good for their confidence. So oh, cool. um, yeah, that's the plan for today. And we'll just see how he goes and sort of come along with him. He's, uh, he's jumped up to like 115 level, so uh, he's, he's done quite a bit, but he hasn't been out jumping for a while, so we're just taking it, taking it steady yeah. and, you know, just seeing how it goes. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just a man on a wire, hanging up here. They call me crazy, but I'm beginning to change. It was so lovely to see you and Puff do some jumping this afternoon. Um, but also, he's not one of your horses, is he? He's one of your sales liveries, I believe. Yeah. Tell me a bit more about that. So we've been doing this for about a year and I've been getting sort of four different types of liveries yeah. in. So we have sales liveries, competition liveries, schooling liveries and holiday liveries. Oh, cool. um, so it's been really nice seeing all like the different types of horses yeah. come in. Um, particularly like, the schooling liveries I really enjoy because they can come in with like little problems and quirks and yeah. it's so rewarding to sort of ride them through them, you know, and, and get to know them more. And then the sales liveries, it's great. We're finding them new homes and things like Puff today. It's going to be very hard to part with him. Yeah, he's so lovely. <laughs> he's so sweet. I get so attached as well. So yeah. it's a blessing and a curse. Like, I love doing it, but saying goodbye to them yeah. is horrible. Because they're just like mine. They're like yeah. my babies. <laughs> he's only been here two weeks and he's oh. like a baby to me. Um, so yeah, he's uh, he's like Nero as well. Yeah. So he reminds me of him. So it's like saying goodbye to him. Aww. Well, thank you so much for having me today. It's yeah. been such a great day, like seeing what it's like a day in the life of mm -hmm. Kate Lewis or Blob the Cob. And um, it's not over yet. Oh really? Yeah. Uh, they're still outside. Oh. So yeah. we have them all to get in again. Yeah. And hang up and feed and everything. So we're probably gonna get in quite late. Yeah. <laughs> it's, been, it's been a long day. Was it like has four been a long this morning day. That we started? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Four o'clock, yeah. we're turning out, then heading to the beach. Yeah, so uh, let's go get them in then. Let's get them. <laughs> well, I don't mind the slow down anymore. I don't mind the sound of my shoes on your floor. Don't mind selling out or playing cover song Just as long as friends and family sing along And I don't need more money or faster car, now. Nah. Don't need a magazine to call me a superstar, now. Nah. I'm gonna take this little house and make a home And then I'll never have to face my nights alone In my heart, I hate Spain And on my face, I feel you breathe Next to me Two by land, by air, by sea And that is how it's supposed to be Now, and that much I can say Now I'm 
Pulling loaves of bread down from the shell And how rare it is that I stay up past twelve In the backyard we are going to start a garden If that don't sound mighty good I beg your pardon Cause in my heart I hear you speak And on my face I feel you breathing to me, to by land, by air, by sea, and that is how it's supposed to be, now, and that much I can say, well I don't mind the slow down anymore, I don't mind the sound of my shoes on your floor, anymore, anymore.